Hi, welcome to Rate This Gear. Today I'll be doing a video review of the 10 ounce professional uh, Everlast MX uh, fight gloves. So these gloves you would use in a professional fight. But one of the things I like about using professional fight gloves in training is that, you know, one thing is, especially if you're a professional fight, I think you should always use um, in training boxing gloves, at least for some mitt work, some uh, heavy bag work, and uh, gloves that you're actually going to be uh, using in a, in a boxing match. Uh, but as far as for your general training, the reason why I like using professional fight gloves is that they tend to be a lot more comfortable than like regular traditional heavy bag gloves. Uh, also, the padding on them is pretty good, but it does wear out quicker. But one of the pluses to that is whenever you're using um, or buying heavy bag gloves, I think it's a good idea not to get you know bulky heavy bag gloves. Usually, should be around you know anywhere from 10 to 12 ounces. You know, using 16 ounce gloves is okay too, but you don't want to have too much cushion because what happens is when you're using um, boxing gloves uh, that have too much cushion or heavy in weight, uh, you know, you tend to not really strengthen your wrists and you tend to not strengthen your knuckles. So you want to strengthen them as you go along. So one of the things I like about this is that these gloves tend to be a lot more comfortable as well as, uh, you know, as the padding wears out as you're hitting it, you know, your hands uh, strengthen also. So, and they're very light, they, you know, as far as the leather construction, the stitching, a lot of the professional gloves tend to last long. The padding wears out, but you know the gloves themselves stay um, pretty. Um, they're very well built. Now, as far as for professional fight, these gloves, you know, how do they compare to something like a Cleto Reyes glove? Uh, and the reason why I bring Cleto Reyes uh, specifically is because these are the Mexican style gloves. These are made in Mexico. Um, a lot of the Everlast like products, they tend to be made like in China and things like that. But these are made in uh, Mexico, and uh, the stitching on these gloves is very, very well done these are not all horse hair uh, construction so this is uh, a foam and a horse hair blend uh, these gloves are very comfortable offer you great support um, comfortable in the uh, thumb area as well so the thumb is always attached at the glove for all professional fights uh, you can open up your palm make a solid fist the great thing about horse hair and foam uh, type of gloves is that when you put them on they tend to be already a lot more broken in because the horse hair is a lot softer and it's just a lot more flexible than say some of the foam gloves. Now as far as it comparing to like uh, a Cleto Rays where it's all made out of, um, you know, all the padding is really horse hair. Uh, I'd say that this feels a little bit more comfortable and it feels that it has a lot more cushion and more protection. But um, I always say, you know, for professional fighters, try different gloves and see which ones work the best for you because there is a, a you know, a learning curve, so to speak, that you have to get used to the glove as you use them on a heavy bag. Um, or in training because you know you'll see that if you risk a take it sometimes when the glove is all made out of horse hair uh, or you know professional fight glove you really have to see how it feels to you so you know for training purposes for professional fighters I think it's a great thing to uh, to use a professional fight glove as far as this and how it compares to some of the other professional fight gloves that I've tested out I think this is um, uh, it's a very good glove it's sort of in between like a Cleto Reyes and uh, like an Everlast glove. I mean, this is an, Ever an Everlast glove, but I think this is a, a very comfortable glove and to some maybe uh, it will offer a lot more support or it will feel like it'll offer a little bit more support than a Cleto Reyes uh, professional fight glove with the horse hair. So with that said, this is a very good glove, but again, test them out, see how you like them. Um, it's great in training, very good glove, very good quality. And uh, I like this glove a lot. I'll be using it a lot in training. So I hope you've enjoyed this review. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more videos.